happy tune. So we'll go through what we got on the drums here. Go to 58. Hey! Up on the staircase. M160's a little lower than we did last time. Ryan Williams says he thinks that it'll be better for picking up low end of the drums. We're getting some great sounds today. Say hello. hello. Introduce yourself, man. Hey, I'm Johnny. Hey, I'm Johnny. Johnny's been uh, helping us out here at the studio. So anyway, we got M160s. We've got a Telefunken Copperhead for like a Zep mic. Uh, Audix D6 Outkick. Beta 52 in. 421s on the toms. 57 snare top and bottom. Charter Oak 538B Ride, SM81 on uh, hi hats, a pair of Clarion or Loudon Clarions is overs, and and Tarek brought this new ride, and this thing is killer. What is it, a 21 inch rock ride? Yep. Zildjian, really nice ride. Got this 14 and a half, both 6 and a half by 14 Black Beauty. Uh, Yamaha Custom 13, 16, 18, 24. Coded ambassadors on the tops. Yeah, was that rock and solo? <laughs> <laughs> we have a scratch track. train station getting ready to go home man <laughs> this is the big screen <laughs> when I wrote this tune you know I, I wrote the, the first verse is just kind of uh about walking around Amsterdam, going to Dom Square, and um, seeing everybody on the bikes, and yeah. and then the se you don't smoke, do you? No. Oh, okay. I was gonna say you're going out for a smoke break, are you? Occasionally. You do really? <laughs> Very rarely. All right, it's on video now. I know. So you're gonna not bother yeah. No, I don't. Do that. I'm, just, I'm just joshing you. Yeah, I got you. Second verse, we went for. Uh, a second verse I started writing kind of more introspective and then and I was like you know what? I, I just want the song to be fun and I started thinking about everything that happened when I was over there and uh, I ended up at my friend's house up in uh, I can't think of it it's like right by Enkels in like kind of the upper just north east corner of the main area of um, Netherlands and a buddy of ours showed up on his boat, and I just went on a boat ride with him. It was so beautiful, and we ended up pulling up to like a little island dock, and we get out, open up, and, a, and there's a bar in there, and we open up, and the band is playing. It's like their big national holiday for their village or whatever, and I end up jumping up on stage and singing, and it was just the best time, so that's what, that's what the second verse is about. Kind of like smoke on the water in a way, like kind of just about like the event and about the time, and... Anyway, that's it. I'm really excited about this tune. Uh, I think it's going to be really... I hope it's going to be really good. I'm going to go for a much raw sound on guitars. Possibly use my Junior with P90s and, you know, maybe some Vox action and Orange. And I'm doing a record right now for a guy and he's into, like, kind of more of the Buck Cherry darkness kind of sound. So we've been getting this, like, kind of classic GNR thing going on and it's been fun a lot of orange and, and uh, martial orange so I don't know we'll see but anyway we're ready to hit these drums man they're sounding great and uh, anyway this is uh, this is gonna be the video of the making of Amsterdam take it we're taking you from scratch tracks to master yeah, you're
Can I have me a water? Yeah. Oh, no, I got one. I got one. All right, so we just did like a little comp track. We organized all our parts for it. I should have been filming some of that. That was really fun. You would have gotten to see me play air drums. But anyway, the part is just killer. <laughs> and uh, as my friends in, in uh, Portugal say, killer. Killer. <laughs> it's, it's, it's just killer, man. Killer. But anyway, so here's like our little comp track. And now uh, what I usually do is listen through it like with the drummer. So it gives him also a chance now to just listen to all the parts, get it in his head. And then we're going to come back and crush this with some really nice stuff. Good job, Mr. Tarek. Mm -hmm. The only drummer named after chocolate. That's right. <laughs> Mr. Ghirardella. Or candy, for that matter. <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm more of a chocolate than a candy guy. punch was because you did a little fill in the middle and I just punched it on the one yeah so that was yeah it was just a little, uh, <laughs> a little operator well no I didn't realize you were going to do the schmageggy and the schmutzy yeah I, I just thought you were going to do the focaccia and yeah the and you did the schmageggy and the schmutzy <laughs> you throw me off man there we go I love that back in fact, it's, it's so primitive. I love it, though. It's really nice. That's awesome. Tara Ghirardella, named after chocolate. <laughs> Sex sexual chocolate. <laughs> that's that big moment. That's what Michael Brower talks about, finding that moment in the song. And that's the moment. Big screen, the whole world. Quick notes. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
dude, that'd be totally whack. Yowza. <laughs> All right, man. You got it, Kiridella? Let's go. Shouldn't have told me. All right. Well, Tarek, your job is to not suck. Because you're <laughs> being videotaped. It'll, you'll get it. 